everyone, I'm Charles Kraft, a registered nurse and senior consultant on the clinical operations team at Cardinal Health. In today's video on preventing catheter-associated urinary tract infections, or CAUTI, we'll review the U.S. Centers for Disease Control, or CDC's guidelines for CAUTI prevention, as well as appropriate indications for use of Foley catheters. Remember that one strategy to prevent CAUTI is to avoid their use entirely when there's not an appropriate indication. Alternatives to inserting a Foley catheter must be considered, and we will cover numerous options for you here as well. Let's get started. Urinary tract infections are classified as HAIs, or healthcare-associated infections. 75% of UTIs are related to urinary catheter use. CDC guidelines for CAUTI prevention provide indications for Foley catheter use that include the patient has acute urinary retention or bladder outlet obstruction. There is a need for accurate measurements of urinary output in the critically ill patient. In perioperative use for selected surgical procedures. Patient undergoing urologic surgery or other surgery on contiguous structures of the genital urinary tract. Anticipated prolonged duration of surgery. Remember, catheters inserted for this reason should be removed post-op in the PACU. Large volume infusions or administration of diuretics during surgery is anticipated. There is a need for intraoperative monitoring of urinary output to assist in healing open sacral or perineal wounds in incontinent patient. The patient requires prolonged immobilization to improve comfort for end of life care if needed. If appropriate indications for Foley insertion are not met, consider using alternatives to an indwelling urethral catheter. Alternatives can include male external catheters, intermittent catheterization, incontinent briefs, and or absorbent underpads. If you're seeking more info on how to prevent CAUTI, please contact your local Cardinal Health sales representative. They'd be happy to help. We hope you found this video informative and interesting. Thank you for your time.